definitely in that top five MVP MVP conversation. And you got to throw Kyrie in there too, some way, somehow. Kyrie's been playing phenomenal. In the MVP uh, conversation? Kyrie, I, shit, I would get Yeah, hell yeah. Kyrie, why not? Got to. Bro. Bro. Those numbers, man. Like the 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 the, the, the on, bro, they're 12 and one. 12 and one <laughs> in this stretch right now. The only loss is the game that Kyrie did. I mean, most of this is due to you know just James Harden setting up the just the, the whole team. But man, the way Kyrie's been playing, bro, it's been like lights out. Like he hasn't really had too many bad games or off games. Like, damn, he was in a funk tonight. He's just really been stepping up, man. It's, it's beautiful to watch. Damian Lillard even comp- complimented Kyrie tonight. He says the, the most beautiful game style of play I've ever seen. He Damian Lillard said that shit. So I mean, a lot, a lot of, a lot of players around the league giving Kyrie his props this year. Uh, Dame said that a couple of nights ago on Instagram, but I don't think even with Embiid on Philly, I think that's the problem with with Philly. If you if you watch them now. They kind of play the same. The, the, it's almost like they were built around Simmons, and they're not built around Embiid. And that's kind of you'll see Embiid take over because he has to. At the end of a game against against the Utah game, he had a classic, like uh, uh, epitome of an Embiid game. So when you see it, to me, an MVP, they always have these moments and these takeovers. And especially the culture of the team, the culture of these New York Nets, of the Brooklyn Nets, that's James Harden. Like, I, I think if that whole thing about MVP conversation, what at what at what position, what number are you putting Kyrie Irving in? I think that's, like, disrespectful. What number is he coming in? Because you got Embiid, Harden in, is in the mix, so he might be one number three. Who's number two? Gian, I still got Giannis in number two. I don't think Kyrie Irving means more to the Nets. Than Giannis does to the Bucks. No, I, 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 no, I hear what you're saying. It's just that to not have that. I'm not saying he is the MVP, but if you you're gonna have this conversation right now, the way he's playing, he's just as valuable to that team. You know what I'm saying? Like he's an asset. Like you put him on a certain other team, like he's gonna he's gonna the way he he's been playing, he's gotta have that conversation. His name gets tossed in that conversation. I'm not saying he is the MVP. But I'm not even the only one that's been saying this. Like, this talk is just not me bringing this shit up because uh, he's balling out of control. He's not taking no one's name on that list. You got, obviously, Joel Embiid, but he's hurt now. You got Joel Embiid. You got James Harden. Still got to throw LeBron in there. Who else Who else comes to mind for you? I it think um, Jimmy he got Butler. hurt. That was another. I Jimmy think Butler? Jimmy Butler means more to Miami. Than, than Kyrie Irving ever will. Kyrie Irving, before James Harden got there, he he was, again, he was still kind of a space cadet. He didn't have it all together. It, he felt way more comfortable. He missed a couple games. And he, you know, whatever happened in his life, personal life, I don't know. I don't want to judge him. But Harden took this team to another level. And that's without KD being there. So if this was the Oscars and they had a co-star award, sure. <laughs> Give Kyrie's up for the co-star award. But not in the the MV the MVP conversation. I that is all media bullshit that they don't even know how to come up with. Just yo, just say he's having a great year. And if there's a Robin Oscar, but that sounds too disrespectful for you know for for jocks and athletes, they would never come up to you know want to get the Robin Award. But you should have a co-star award so that people don't feel bad. And Kyrie Irving has been a great co-star. He's a great number two. But James Harden is a great number one. I, I think right now he he uh his name gets inserted in that conversation. That's just me though. But 